Hello everyone. This video here is a tutorial of how to set up an NPC that will sail by and kind of walk around and kind of a path to walk around through different places, whatever. So this video will be pretty much just an example of how to do it in just one NPC, but you can choose to not do that in certain NPCs. So first we're going to start by deciding what this NPC is going to sell. I'm going to make this NPC where? Let's see. I already made one there. Um, hmm. I think I'll make the NPC over here. So, first off, make sure you have the plugin Citizens, Detail Traders, and an Economy plugin. I am using the BOS Economy or whatever, Bose Economy, however you want to say it. So, Trader, Create, Druggy. Now, what this NPC is going to do is buy and sell certain things such as little drugs and everything that you can sell to him and buy to him or buy from him. Sugar and wheat. I have a little drug mod so you can use these little drugs. I might show that in a new video or something eventually. But So first off you will make sure that you're in manager mode. You can left click him and it will say down at the bottom manager mode enabled or disabled so it is enabled now we will right click them so this is it this is what we have now sometimes the sell and buy stock get confusing I don't know why but I never get them right sometimes so I don't know if this is going to be it so we're going to go ahead and unlock stock and put wheat in and sugar in and lock the stock and now we need to edit the prices I like to get oak woods depending on your prices of course if you have low prices or decimals or giant prices that are like thousands of dollars but so I'm going to make where the wheat is mm, 10 and the sugar will be 15 All right so we're gonna go and exit this left click to exit manager mode and buy it to make sure yep okay so that is the buy stock that's what you will buy from him so you can now buy that from them. We have them two items. So we're going to go ahead and left click them again and set up where you can actually sell the wheat to them. So here we will want to get wheat and sugar again. Change the stock to sell stock. Unlock it again. Put in wheat and sugar. Lock it. Go to price management. And use the oak wood to edit the prices. I want it to be a little bit under since the buy price is always a little more usually. So instead you set it for 7 and sell that for 12 and close out of manager mode and there we have it sell stock can't buy these because you sell it so let's give myself a bunch of sugar so random amount to see all right so 15 times 12 pretty much and it'll actually show the price right there you don't have to go to switching the stocks if you want to sell it I think you just left click it and it'll sell it I made $180 or coins really and now I have 229 because I had some before now that we have this NPC done he's not moving and he's not looking at us he's kinda just standing there like a derp face now there might be a way to change the skin but I'm not entirely sure I'm still figuring that out that could be a separate plugin so now that we want him to change the path and look at us we're going to do NPC whoops, NPC select then NPC look once he is selected and he will look at us alright that is confirmed working obviously <laughs> now we're going to set him a path so then type NPC path and now what you do here is you can left click to add the waypoints to where you want him to go and right click to remove the waypoints so I want him to move this way there he is. Now we just got to keep on going. I like to try to make it pretty close by because you can't make it but so far away. Otherwise, you might get confused and not be able to go that far. Just making him go back and forth to these random areas to take a lot of time. Alright. He's going to go throughout all of this stuff. 
And I will make him turn around. Actually, I'll make him turn around here. Then he's going to walk all the way back. Okay, I'm going to make him walk through here, uh, might not be the best idea actually, and of course you can set your own little NPC path to wherever you really want it to be, I just happen to be changing him to move around this kind of area, it's a lot of pathing. <laughs> And I'm done with the waypoints. So now you will type NPC path and I will exit the little waypoint editor. So now if I do that, it will destroy the grass block. So now he should go on his little path. Now he's honestly he's going a little too fast for this, so I'm gonna change his speed. So I'm gonna make him go NPC speed. Um point eight or seven. Point seven he walks a little too slow and he kinda looks a little glitchy. So, I kind of like to do point eight. It makes it look like he's walking. Alrighty. There he is, walking. Minding his own business. Okay, so it looks like he's kind of being stupid with the NPC look. When you kind of get close to him, he's kind of freaking out. So, I'm going to turn that off. Because he is on like a little path. So, now the only problem that I've noticed with having like a trader that actually moves around is you can right click him and he doesn't stop and you can just keep trading but oh well there's a few flaws there might be a way to fix it eventually but it works now what I usually like to do is add traders into separate buildings over here I have other things like stables and fish and armor and you can have a bunch of items so here's the blacksmith all the items that I have you can do stuff like this all these items and even some horse armor. Alright, so I believe that will be all. Thank you for watching. Make sure to check out my other videos and I hope this tutorial has helped you.